Starbucks CEO addresses impact of Israel Hamas war on sales. Starbucks CEO Laxman Narasimhan attributes the drop in U.S. store traffic to misperceptions about its position on events in the Middle East, hinting at the impact of the Israel Hamas war on sales. Starbucks faced criticism for its messaging about the conflict in Gaza, with customers accusing the company of taking a stance against Israel. Starbucks Workers United, the national union for the company's baristas, posted a pro-Palestine statement on Instagram, leading to a lawsuit from Starbucks and further customer boycotts. In a recent investor call, Starbucks CEO carefully addressed the ongoing conflict in the Middle East without naming specific parties involved. The CEO expressed deep concern for the violence in the region, condemning violence, hate, and weaponized speech, while emphasizing support for partners and stakeholders affected by the situation. Despite falling short of Wall Street's expectations, Starbucks stock surged nearly 4% to 97.71, showcasing investor confidence in the company's leadership during challenging times. More than 25,000 Palestinians have been killed during Israel's war in Gaza, following Hamas's attack on Israel that killed about 1,200 people in the country. The war has led to accusations of genocide against Israel, which Israel denies.